the B-1 as we matured in the system, moving away from the nuclear capability into the conventional realm, I think blossomed this aircraft into such a strategic platform. The fact that we had uh, two ISOs in the back, that the way we could uh, hand off the capabilities of the, of the various weapon systems. The technology was great as we started going into smart precision weapons at 200 feet with the high resolution radar. It was just phenomenal from what I saw back in the B-52 days with the radar. Blobology is what we used to call it. I um, mean, and, and then when we did the high resolution map, uh, we could paint fence posts, whether we were at 200 feet or we were at 25,000 feet. Very accurate to confirm that take those coordinates off the radar and actually feed that into the weapon system and drop it. So very good straight capability. After 9-11, when we went into Afghanistan with the JDAMs, just we were a precision capable bomber. And if you look at historically now from all the missions from Desert Fox on this point, the aircraft that brings the most payload to the fight has been the B-1.